Hello and welcome everyone. This is Dark Lord again with another Lots of Fallen video. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can chase the boss called Sacred Resonance of Tenacity. But to do that, basically, you have to first take out this parasite here. Uh, you can easily do that without triggering the boss even. So just take it out. And after that, we are going to take care of the monks which are sitting outside the chamber. And then we will start the cheese. And you will be very much amazed to see that we won't even fight the boss and we will defeat the boss without even fighting. But for, for taking out the box obviously we have to find them so we just take them out uh, so just be careful about because like the boss tries to defend them as well uh, so just make sure that you are away, uh, you are away from the boss uh, he has a very powerful move set so just make sure that he doesn't uh, slam you with his hammer it will take out most of your hp so now the first monk is done so we are going on the other side to take out the other monk well there are i think two or three of them uh, which you have to take them out because the main thing is like otherwise they will uh, uh, keep on using some magic and they will interfere with the cheese otherwise it's, it's it's not even necessary but that's a better to do that so just let's take them out uh so where are you so here it is let's take it out oh my goodness the boss is coming behind it <laughs> <laughs> you can see like uh, he's taking a large chunk of my HP uh, my goodness yep so just let's take take him out so here it goes just one more now okay so here it goes so now all three of them are gone and we are going to take care of the boss now so what you have to do is basically you have to run across this chamber and then you have to take these stairs up on the left side uh, let me show you easily the boss is very near and he's charging up against me so just let's let me show you uh, clearly he's charging up his hammer so he basically he can slam it uh, on the ground which gives a lot of damage and he can also uh, just hit on his helmet a bell shaped helmet which in which causes uh, this resonance or uh, like this um, and you have to basically dodge it inwards or outwards you have to basically avoid the first uh, wave of this uh, resonance so you have to basically come up here and then you have to stay here now the boss will follow you and then once the boss comes here you have to jump from this uh, down and the boss will also follow you <laughs> and he will also jump from here but he doesn't know that once he jumps he loses a lot of his health so just let's get down here okay so i also lost some health uh, that's okay uh, but let him you can see like he lost 2000 hp so that's how we are going to do it so let's take care of this one as well let's just need some more vigor <laughs> yep so where are you okay so he is inside here so let's get on the stairs again and here we go so now we are going to stay on the platform here just let the boss come once he is up on the stairs then we will just wait for him to come up on the stairs uh, so that he doesn't come back uh, from the stairs so just come down like this and now he will also follow you and just have a look at it and he lost 2273 hp ah my goodness that's a lot of junk oh we have to keep repeating that a few times maybe three or four times i think four or five times maybe and then he will die uh, while jumping so let's just increase up the pace of this uh, video because it's a repeated procedure we are not doing anything special we are just making him fall you can see every time he falls he loses more than 2000 hp and that's how we are going to do it we are not going to fight him even well sometimes it feels a little bit guilty that we are not even fighting the bosses but i like to cheese these bosses anyways uh he is more than half of his hp down he can't do anything i mean he, he can just the, the only thing that you have to be careful about is his resonance attack where he taps up his uh, helmet and that uh, causes a huge wave of this yellow color wave of resonance which can give you a lot of damage so just make sure that you are avoiding that otherwise yeah this one i'm talking i was talking about otherwise you are good to go you can see like the boss's health is almost done and this should be the last jump he is making the last jump of his life and we are done with him well uh that's how you defeat the boss now there is another secret thing uh, a bonus for those who are watching up till now once you defeat the boss then you have to go back up the same stairs and take up a secret magic uh, which is called as adir's hardiness but the thing is you need pilgrim's key to open up a door over there which i assume that everyone have it because obviously you have reached this far probably by opening up the gate uh, near the bell room uh, on the left side so I, I hope everyone might have it so so we have to open up this one uh, so once you open up this pilgrim's purse key uh, you
using progress first key you can go inside and take up the chest and here is the magic well that's it for the video i hope you like it if you do please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to watch more lots of fallen related videos thank you for watching and have a very nice day